He gets his five, he gets his five. Come on. Okay, guys, 24, seven golf. How are you doing? Welcome, YouTubers. Welcome, TikTokers. Hope you're doing good. Now, listen, I'm going to be doing like a new little mini series of traveling around, playing the four toughest holes on the golf courses. So, stroke index is one to four and showing you how difficult they are. I'm at Huffwood Golf Club today, Huffwood Golf Club in Crank. And this is stroke index number two because of hole number five. It's a par five into wind. Let's see how we get on, eh? Par five into wind, stroke index two. Let's see how we get on, come on. That's a great ball, right down the middle. Just drifting a little touch towards the right. It's a great shot though. Yes, into wind as well, take it all day. Come on, baby. Let's go. Right, guys, it just shows you how strong that wind is. I've just hit a nice drive there, to be honest, like, but it's probably gone about 220, if that. Um, it's into wind. It's probably a one and a half club, two club wind. So I'm just going to hit a seven nine because we've got a ditch that goes across the fairway at 180. Uh, sorry, 170. So I'm just going to hit a seven nine and hopefully get it in play. Just drop it before the ditch, so I've got a wedge or a, a nine iron in, you know. You've got to play smart, haven't you? Got to play smart, guys. And a little bit of a down slope. We may go a little bit right, so. It's a great shot. Absolute pitch right down the middle. Position A. Position A, guys. No excuses from there. Let's go. Right, guys, if it's a cracker shot right down the centre, I've got about 20 yards to that ditch, so I'm going to rate now a 9-9 because -nine I've got 117 into the flag, wind against. So I'm going to try and play a little cut off the left-hand side of the green towards the pin. And, um, yeah, just trust it. Just trust it and uh, just let the wind do its job, really. That's a great shot if it's big enough. Oh, what a shot. Go on, be nice. Oh, I can't see it. Oh, it's pin eye. Pin eye, come on, baby. Where's me divach? What a shot that was. What a shot. Isn't it nice when you hit a shot? And it works out the way you do. do you know what? I've been practicing on the range, that's why I'm hitting it all right today. Right, so I've got a birdie putt. Unbelievable, or what? Quite remarkable. But three excellent shots. Three excellent shots to get me here. Yeah. Let's see what we can do, eh? Soak index two. I would take a five now all day. Come on. Let's try and roll one in. Oh, I've got a testy one, guys. I've got a testy one. Didn't hit it, did I? Wow. I think it's left edge and firm. That was a terrible puff of a birdie, that one, eh? How bad was that? Come on. Straight back, straight through. He gets his five, he gets his five. Come on. A poor puff for birdie, but he gets his five, so stroke index two. Because I get a shot on there, so it's all right, isn't it? One under my handicap after the first one. Next is hole nine, which is stroke index four, I think. Let's get over there. Come on, look at the sun as well. October, come on. Okay, guys. Hole number nine for the one to four stroke index challenge. Huffle Golf Club, this is stroke index four. It's a little bit of breeze behind today, so what, a one club breeze, something like that, not much. But um, yeah, so your line is kind of right at that tree and a little draw because it dog legs down to the, uh, to the left. So that's the line or tiger line over the top. What's Baz gonna do? <laughs> God knows, God knows. Let's see what we can do, eh? 
Let's see what we can do. Just up the right hand side, get past the bunkers. Yeah, past them. Yes, it's past, good. Yeah, he's all right there. Yeah, a little bit of a fade on him. But he's in play, come on! Right guys, I've hit me drive down the right hand side because I had that little bit of fade on it. It hasn't gone very far, but it is wet conditions as well. Look at the sun, it's gorgeous. Anyway, I've got pins at the back of the green, so it's 199 into the flag. So because it's wind behind, I'm going to five iron and hope it draws a little bit. So my line is just the edge of the bunker really, because I'm on a slope, it should draw. So let's see what we can do, eh? There's my line on the edge of the bunker. Let's see if we can draw one in onto the dance floor. Take it, uh, take a par or a bogey and get out of here. Just like that. Oh, it's an absolute peach, guys. Yes, middle of the green. Come on, come on, baby. <laughs> As you can see, is where it's pitched here. As you put your pitch marks in and push forward, guys. Don't forget, don't lift it up like that. Because that's the wrong way to do it. Right, so I've carried that probably about what? I've carried that probably 187, something like that. About 187. So I think this is pretty straight, really, from here. Um. So, crack a five and you've got to trust it, haven't you? You've got to trust the slope is going to do the work instead of trying to manipulate it. It's tough, I know it's tough, it really is, but that's what you've got to do, you've got to trust it. So if I can take a two puff from here, I'll be absolutely buzzing. Come on, little two puff from here. Get in, get in. Oh, just drifted off. Just drifted to the right side of going the other way. Well, that just drifted off to the to the left. So this really should just go on the right edge and just drop in. Right edge and let it drop in. Bit of pace to it. Need a little bit of pace to it, guys. Trust it, trust the line. Just like that, come on, come on. <laughs> so, pa, pa, Woof. pa, pa on the um, soak index four and soak index two. The bass has gone pa, pa, two under. Thirteen's the next one, my nemesis hole, but not today. <sighs> and then 15, 24, seven golf, let's go, baby. All right, guys. I am not a happy bunny, I've got to say. Hole 13. <laughs> hole 13, stroke index 3, my nemesis hole, and I've just bogeyed stroke index 17. I had four shots from 47 yards. Four shots. I smashed my drive down the middle. Four shots from 47 yards. Don't ask me how. <laughs> anyway, let it go, let it go. <laughs> right. Right, I need to reset all 13. Soak index three, my nemesis hole. Come on, let's get this down the middle. Come on, let's have a good start. Yeah, he's down the middle in this little fade. Nice, that. Nice little fade on him there. Come on, definitely a three or four shot of this, though. Okay, guys, I'm playing it off the blue today, but that is one of the shortest tee shots. I think it is the shortest tee shot I've ever hit on this hole. Into wind, and it was right off the heel, to be honest, so it's not gone anywhere. Now, there's a ditch at about, must be about 210. So I'm going to hit this rescue. This rescue carries about 195, something like that. So if I can leave myself a 99 into green, I'll be made up, but I need to get it up there first, don't I? Let's uh, see if we can get it up there. Come on. On the other fairway. Terrible shot. Rubbish! On the other fairway, guys, it's going to be a long goal. 
So I've missed my fairway, the 13th. And because it hits the hill, it exaggerates and you know fades down onto the fifth fairway. So fairway found, <laughs> not mine. Anyway, I've got 166 to the pin, but I'm gonna try sort of draw a six iron round. It's a preferred lie, isn't it? Let's get this on a preferred lie. I'm gonna try and sort of, it's a nine iron, so that's no good. Try and draw this six iron. A six iron, come on. Because I need to go over them trees as well, so aim at that bunker on the right. I'm try and play a little sort of draw. And just hope it clears the trees, to be honest. It's a great shot. Wow, get up there. Get up a bit. Oh, it's just on the side of the green. Right over the tree as well. Oh, just a bit just a bit left of the green, but don't quite think he's pin eye, but he's up there though. Not bad that guys. Come on. Chance of up and down. It's way short. Way short than what I thought it was that. Wow. Anyway, I've had three shots, so chance of up and down. Come on. Watch you chip it in. Save messing about. Got a horrible lie. Oh, lovely shot that. Lovely shot, it. Crack a shot that. It's, well, it's gone like six foot past the pin, but got a chance. Nice chip. Come on, nice, didn't it? Right. Just drops off slightly to the right. Just drops off slightly just to say par again. Ooh, can he do it? Can he do it? All over the place one night today. All over the place here on this hole. Come on. Oh, pushed it. Eee. Eee, that was terrible. Six. Bogey. I mean, it's not bad considering where I've been, is it? That was a, that was a, that was an open blade push that instead of releasing the putter. Let's see if I can release it. You never miss, do you? Never miss second time. Hey, you never miss. Anyway, that's a bogey. So for the three holes so far that I've played, I'm one over par. I'll take that. I'd have took that at the start, wouldn't I? Anyway, stroke index one next on the 15th, getting to the 14th now, 24 7 golf. See you in a minute. Okay, guys, this is the final hole in the one to four stroke index challenge. One to four. Anyway, stroke index one, I'm absolutely buzzing because you know the camera was off. Just birdied 14, haven't I? Just missed the green with me approach to the right pin eye. Nice little putter just on the fringe. Travelling, 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 bang it, the flag into the hole. Come on, it's a good job, it would have been 15 foot past. Anyway, you got to take it, haven't you? So, stroke index one, all 15, 455 off the Ellers, so probably 460 off the air, uh, blues, into wind, into a one and a half club wind. If you'd offered me a bogey now, guys, I would bite your hand off. I would bite your hand off. Come on, just like that. Let's get it up there, come on. Come on, let's do it. Four left. He's all right out there. Just over the uh, bushes on the left-hand side, he's on the 11th fairway. Long goal now though, guys, it's a long one. It's a long way to Tickle Mary. Let's go. Pull me drive to the left hand side, a bit noisy here. And um, it's a two club win, so I'm just going to try and get a five iron back in play, to be honest. See what we can do. Back onto the fairway, back in play. See if we can get an up and down, that's all I'm going to do. Let's see if we can do that, eh? Five iron. Beauty, right down the middle. Come on, baby, back in play. Let's go. I've hit an absolute peach of a five iron into the wind there. So I've got 77, 77 to the flag. So it's a little kind of two thirds 
52, a two thirds 52. And let's see if we can get it near the pin, eh? For a uh, tapping par. Tapping par would be nice, wouldn't it? Not gonna happen, like. <laughs> Come on. Just like that. Kick right a bit. Oh, it's a bit short. No way. Ah, oh, the wind held it up. It's on the green, like, but... Ah, it's 20 foot from the pin, guys. Looks like it could be a bog, or even worse. Let's go see. Not a very good shot at all, ah. I'm like 20... 25 foot away from the pin. I'll be doing well to two put this, to be honest. But let's hope I can, eh? Just lag it. Lag it up to the hole and take your bogey. Nice pace, nice pace, beautiful sit. Oh, come on, come on, oosh. That's like backhanded tapping for the bogue. So, um, soak index, soak index is one to four. Baz is only two over par, which I'm absolutely buzzing with. Um, playing off 10. Um, I'm hitting the ball well though. I'm hitting the ball well, guys. Last few days I've been striping it, made a few little changes. I'm gonna do a video on that. A little change to my swing and it's just changed how good I'm striking the ball. Um, anyway, I'm gonna give you a little bonus hole. I know I said it was a smoke index one to four, but hole 16 at Huffwood is a bonus hole because that, in my opinion, is our signature hole. Yeah, so stay around. Come on, let's go to hill 16. It's the next hole. All right, guys, hole number 16. This is your bonus hole. Signature hole at Ruffwood for me, this. All downhill par three, 177 to the pin. So the wind is kind of helping a little bit off that side. Um, so I'm gonna hit six iron and try and kind of draw it a touch into the pin. Or not draw it, but maybe hold it up into the wind. I hold it up a touch, so. The line is just there. It's a cracker shot. It's an absolute beauty. Go on, be right. Be big. Oh, sure, it's half a club out, you know. Guys, <laughs> I was asking for it to go, weren't I? Oh, it's half a club short, guys. It's just on the green. Come on, let's go and have a putt. Miles away. At the front of the green, you see. Half a club out. I mean, it might have been, it might have been a bit better if it actually drew. But it stayed straight, so never mind. Never mind. He's on the dance floor. Can he two put? That's the only thing, isn't it? I would say this is pretty straight. <clears throat> to be honest, I think if anything, it may just come off the right about two cups. Let's try that. Two cups off the right. I would take a lag all day. Come on. I'd take a lag all day. Good pace. <sighs> it was 10 cups to the right. <laughs> it should have been 10 cups to the right. Oh dear me, come on, let's see if I can nail that. Just look at the weather today. 10th of October. 10th of October. And it's absolutely stunning. It must be about 18, 19 degrees. Left edge. Left edge and firm. Left edge and firm, come on. He gets his three, he gets his three, come on. <laughs> he gets him, left edge and firm, that's what it was. Guys, thank you so much. Bye. Guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Uh, hope you've enjoyed the content. Give us a like and a sub if you want to see more content like this. I'm going to be going around different golf courses doing the uh, Stroke Index 1 to 4 challenge. So, um, yeah, give us a thumbs up if you liked it. And uh, don't forget to shout. 
if you hit away with shot next time, 24, seven golf, I'll catch you soon. Twenty-four seven, seven golf. golf.